Hello, this is John Carr with the Mac Gamecast, and today I am going to be showing you how to transfer your Dead Island saves from PC to Mac. Now, Dead Island did just come out for the Mac. You can play it, even though the page still says it's Windows only on Steam, but you can play it. I last played it today. But, uh, the Steam Cloud doesn't seem to be enabled. Maybe. Once the game says it's Steam Play, it'll work, but even then, that's not always the case. But uh, if we play the game on PC before, which I have, and I have some high level characters, one level 39, one level 40, uh, you know, I don't want to start over from scratch. That's quite a few hours put into the game, and I'd rather play those characters. So, how do we do that? Well, step one um, assuming you have Boot Camp installed or some form of access to your drive. Let's open it up here. So we want to go to program files, steam, um, user data. This is your steam user ID. If you happen to have multiple accounts, there'll be more numbers here. But if you don't know, well, you should know your account number anyway. Um, then we're going to go to 91310, which is the Dead Island saves, remote, out, save, and here we go, save 0, 1, 2, I have three characters, so this is them, you can see the dates here, <clears throat> I can remember in my head who I played, I first played in 2011, let's play it around middle of last year, so okay, I got those save files, well, where are the Mac save files, they're basically in the same place, just getting there is a little different due to the Mac file structure, so we're going to go to our user, we're going to go to our uh, library. Where are you, library? There you are. Library is hidden by default. If you don't know how to go there, you can actually uh, go there with the... Um, where is it? You can hold down the option key, actually, and the go menu, and there's a go to your library if you don't have invisible uh, items showing, which I do. And then we are going to go over uh, what is it? App support? Yes. Application support. Steam. In much the same way, we're going to go to user data. Here you see I have two accounts. Um, so I'm going to go to the one that I remember, 46 whatever, that matches. Then I, once again, you're going to go to 30... where are you? Oh, 91310. Excuse me, I had it backwards. Remote out. Now here you see we have a Mac and profiles. Whereas over here it's just the profiles. So, well actually the save is out with the profiles here. Save is inside the Mac. So really what you can do, oops, I did not want to do that. Let's, let's back off. You just uh, drag and drop your saves from over here. You can copy them, copy paste them, drag and drop them, and they will copy over. I'm not going to do that because I've already done mine. Um, I noticed mine were a little funny, by which I mean I copied these over, and when I opened the game, the files worked, but one of them was missing. One of my main characters was missing at a level 1 character, and two high level characters. Only one of my high level characters was showing. So I had to actually end up renaming these files. I think my high level character is. Uh, one and two or something like that, or zero and two, whatever, and I had to actually just literally rename it from two to zero, open the game, and then it showed up. Um, I actually had to do this with both my high-level characters to get them to work, but it's fairly, it might take you a little bit of trial and error to, you know, muck, muck with your files, but uh, it'll work just fine, <clears throat> and to prove it, I will open the game real quick. Um, if you've already started some new games on the Mac side, and, um, well, I guess you could just rename those too. 03, 04, 05. I actually didn't think to try that. Let's get past this stuff. 
And as you can see, here we go. I have a level 39 character and level 41 character that I transferred over from the PC side. So it works just fine. You just may have to play around a little with it. If you only have one character, it'll probably copy over just fine. But if it doesn't, just try the rename. And anyone who wants to play with me, I wouldn't mind playing a new game or a high level play. So just add me as Ripper on Steam. And see you on Dead Island.